Welcome to ECCV 2020. It is my pleasure to present the ECCV papers from the TOM Visual Computing Lab and our collaborators. Enjoy watching! We present SceneCAD. RGBD scans tend to be very noisy and incomplete. We aim to transform them into a clean, compact CAD representation. Our approach predicts scene layouts and CAD model alignments and intercorrelates them with each other. Through our joint object layout estimation, we produce a globally consistent lightweight CAD representation of the scene. To train our approach, we present a richly annotated real-world scene layout dataset. In the CAD alignment task, our approach produces more accurate alignments and provides additional layout estimates. In summary, SceneCAD jointly optimizes for object arrangements and scene layouts in RGBD scenes. Thank you for watching. We present ScanRefer, a method to tackle our new task of 3D object localization in RGBD scans using natural language. Given a 3D scene and a description for an object as input, our goal is to output the 3D bounding box for the object. We introduce a localization network and the ScanRefer dataset for training and benchmarking. For the provided ScanNet instances, we collect the associated descriptions regarding the object's appearance as well as relative spatial location information. Our method takes as input the point cloud for a scene and a freeform description for an object. The detection module predicts point clusters, which are further used by the proposal module to produce individual object proposals and object masks. The localization module and language classifier predicts the target object bounding box and the class labels for the input description. The qualitative results show that our method is capable of localizing target objects in a given 3D context. Thanks for watching. We present CAD Deform, a method to improve the quality of 3D scene reconstruction with a set of 3D CAD models. Our goal is to go from a noisy 3D scan and a collection of CAD models to a high-quality scene reconstruction. We start with a voxelized scene scan and a set of meshes. Retrieve and align CAD models to scan fragments, but unlike existing methods, also non-rigidly non deform retrieved 3D model to obtain more accurate CAD-to-scan fits. Our key contribution is a new deformation formulation aiming to match the scan data as closely as possible, maintain continuity and deformation smoothness, penalize deviation from the original shape, and preserve perceptually important sharp geometric features of the mesh. Our resulting deformations achieve tighter fits, while significantly outperforming the baselines according to multiple criteria for visual quality assessments, including a user study. We explore how to enable machines to model 3D shapes like human modelers using reinforcement learning. Inspired by artist-based modeling, we propose a two-step neural framework named Premagent and Mesh Agent based on reinforcement learning to model 3D shapes. The modeling agents interact with the environment by executing actions and collecting rewards to learn 3D modeling policies. In our framework, given a shape reference, the pre-agent will operate a set of predefined primitives to approximate the target shape. The mesh agent will learn to edit the meshes based on edge loops to create detailed geometry. To effectively train the modeling agents, we propose a novel training algorithm that jointly combines heuristic policy, imitation learning, and reinforcement learning. Welcome to check our paper to find more interesting insights of the modeling agents. Thank you. Hey Siri, can you show me your face? Sure. What about this one? With neural voice puppetry I can have every face you like. You can also control different faces just with your voice. Let's have a look at some results. This is all wrong. I shouldn't be up here. I should be back in school on the other side of the ocean. Science makes progress by steps. Most of those steps are small, some are slightly bigger. Uh, seen from the outside, sometimes people have the impression that, oh, there's this big breakthrough, breakthrough, and journalists like to talk about breakthrough, 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 breakthrough. But actually, science is very, very progressive because we gradually understand better the world. 
our pipeline consists of a generalized neural network that maps audio input to a latent audio expression space. This shared space is used to drive a person-specific expression model that is rendered using a neural renderer.